Our team just attended the HAI Helicopter Expo in Anaheim, California last week, and so I thought now would be a great time to talk a little bit about helicopter insurance. If you either own or are looking at buying a helicopter, this video is for you. In my career, I have insured hundreds of helicopters, and these are the four most common mistakes people make when searching for helicopter insurance. Number one, don't underestimate the cost of helicopter insurance. All rotor wing insurance policies are significantly more expensive than single engine land aircraft insurance policies. The average aircraft insurance policy costs around $2,800 a year, versus the average helicopter insurance policy costs around $13,000 a year. There are two main coverages on a helicopter insurance policy. The first is liability coverage, which usually runs between three and $4,000 a year. And the second is physical damage coverage. Physical damage or hull coverage is the most expensive part of a helicopter insurance policy and the cost of your insurance policy will increase based on the value of the helicopter you own or are looking to insure. If you are looking at an $800,000 Robinson versus a $2 million Bell 206, the Bell 206 is gonna be significantly more to insure because of the whole value, and it's also a turbine versus a piston helicopter. Number two, don't forget to compare the deductibles when reviewing insurance quotes. Most single engine land aircraft insurance policies have nil or zero deductibles, but helicopter insurance policies have usually between a five or a 10% deductible. That's five or 10% of the whole value of the helicopter and it makes a big difference. The first thing that people usually do when they get a helicopter insurance quote is they look at the cost, the total premium of that insurance policy rather than looking at the deductibles. If you have an $800,000 Robinson R44, for example, with 10% deductibles, that's an $80,000 deductible if you have an accident or incident. You might have two different helicopter insurance quotes come in. One, let's say it's $13,000 a year with a 10% deductible, and another quote that's $15,000 a year with a 5% deductible. On an $800,000 policy, that's a $40,000 difference if you have an accident. And what that really means is for $2,000 more a year, you can eliminate and reduce your risk by up to $40,000 if you have an accident or incident. Number three, you need to consider the training requirements for each quote. Each insurance company is gonna have different training requirements on the quote, and the financial and time cost for you based on these requirements could make a significant difference in the quote you choose. As an example, a lower priced helicopter insurance quote might have really high training requirements like ground and flight school versus a higher priced helicopter insurance quote might just require a CFI checkout. Make sure that when you're reviewing and comparing helicopter insurance quotes with your broker, you don't just look at the total premium, you also look at training requirements and deductibles. Number four, make sure you don't call one of the mainstream insurance companies in the US for a helicopter insurance quote. You need to call an aviation insurance specialist broker like BWI or one of our competitors. You want someone that knows all the ins and outs of helicopter insurance that's gonna get you the best rate and a great policy. A lot of the larger non-aviation insurance agencies will actually call us when they get a helicopter risk because we have more knowledge and experience and access to the insurance companies that insure helicopters. That's it. I know there's a lot that I didn't get to cover in this video, so if you have a specific helicopter insurance question, drop it in the comments below and I'll try and respond. Thank you for trusting BWI and fly safe.